Radio Giornale Bellunese, now airing. Daily news from the Belluno province. Welcome to a new edition of the Radio Giornale Bellunese. These are the news from today, August 3, 2022. Tragedy in Salce in the night between Monday and Tuesday. A lightning strike on the Arrigoni family's house killed the dentist Giambattista and gravely injured his wife. According to reconstructions, the lightning strike burned the electric panel. The doctor went to see what had happened and was killed by the carbon monoxide emissions. The wife was able to be brought to the hospital. Today will be held the autopsy of Nicolò Feltrin, the three-year-old child who died on the 28th of July in Pieve di Cadore's hospital after a sudden illness. The child is thought to have eaten something he found on the ground while playing in the park, though the possibility that he ate something toxic he found at home has not, had, has not yet been ruled out. The autopsy will allow to understand what caused the poisoning. Climbers stuck on the Spigolo de Lagnier. The shoe were rescued after a night spent on the mountain's face during a storm. After they were surprised by the storm while climbing, they took shelter and called for help. The Dolomiti emergency helicopter found them in the morning and brought them to the San Lucano Valley. An accident happened yesterday afternoon in Limana. A woman went out of the road and ended up under the guardrail, breaking both it and the roof of the car. Fortunately, the woman sustained no injuries. Another accident happened in Passo San Boldo, where two cars, one driven by an 85-year-old man and the other by a woman in her 30s, had an head-on collision. The man needed to be brought to the hospital, though he was not in critical condition. Finally, sports, football. This Monday began Dolomiti Bellunesi's retreat in San Vito di Cadore. With his new coach Lucio Brando, the team gathered after the training in Libano, in Libano di Serico. An injury sustained by the goalie Julius Virvilas is being observed. Medical exams suggest that it's only a minor, a minor muscular problem. And that's all for today's edition. We wish you a nice day in the company of Radio ABM, the Bellunesi and Mondo Association's web radio. You just listened to Radio Giornale Bellunese, daily news from the Belluno province.